All the way to the finish line, Emily Heller. What's up guys? I hope you're safe and healthy and happy and doing okay. Um, well today, Ariana and I, I'm trying to get her in the shop. I don't know how wide this lens is. Uh, Ariana and I are going to a race at a local brewery. Uh, it's a 7.1 mile race. Turn left. And we're just doing it for fun. Usually these brewery races are like fun. You can get like a beer afterwards. And it's a nice flat course, so we figured why not. Um, Kate is injured, sadly, so she couldn't be here today. But I know she's gonna be back out there soon with us. Um, honestly, so we're, we're in a little bit of a pickle here. <laughs> the uh, package pickup stops, it's a hard stop allegedly, at 8.15. And right now we're slated to get there at 8.13. So not sure how that's gonna go, but we're gonna find out. Ariana ran three miles before this because she has 10 miles to run today and her last long run before New York, which is literally a week from today. So that's exciting. At this time next week, I'll be about to get on the Staten Island Ferry to Staten Island. Wow. Amazing. It's crazy. Yep. She's killed it, this training cycle. She's done a great job. And now we're gonna finish off her long runs with this little race. Today I'm rocking the endorphin speed. No, let's start over. <laughs> Today I'm rocking the endorphin pro plus. And they feel comfortable. So I can't imagine it going poorly, but we're gonna, we're gonna find out. All right, got the bib. Was a little touch and go there for a second. Oh, we made it. Oh, this national anthem. Definitely on a little wonky, It's a little crooked. It's more than a little crooked. All right, <laughs> well, maybe we can fix it. it. It's like, just, it's not crooked, just like off-center. It's a little off-center. <laughs> but this is a very touch-and-go situation. <laughs> well, we almost didn't make it. Yeah. Ready? Overall, um, coming off of Chicago, that's pretty expected. Definitely not gonna hit sevens today, I don't think. I feel okay. I could feel better, but I could feel worse. So let's finish this out. We'll report back at like a mile left. like 
808810. <coughs> definitely ready to be done. Um, I'm not killing my body, but I'm definitely working. So excited to see the finish line. And the course is very flat, easy. Um, and the volunteers are awesome. So thank you for getting out here. Let's finish this up. I got some beads. Nice. Just what I need. She's videoing her with the GoPro all the way to the finish line. Emily Heller. Yeah. Thank, you. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Oh my god. Oh, that's so which is like an 8.05 pace. Not bad, coming off of Chicago. I haven't really been doing any speed work, so it would be kind of silly for me to think I'd be anywhere near seven minutes of miles, but I had fun. Now we're gonna sit here, get some water, and wait for Ariana to be done. Woo! <laughs> Sprinted it! Ariana Constantine. Let's go! Woo! Jill, excuse me. Jillian Surrey Finn is just in. Here's Ariana Comac with that uh, Blue Point 10 mile run to the brewery shirt. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice job. How do you feel? Oh, that's some, that's something, man. It was some metal? Yeah. yeah. Good job. How'd you feel? You're doing good. I'm gonna get one of each. What do you think? I think that's too many. <laughs> Thank you. Um, not exactly the um, healthiest of choices, but this cake was kind of forced upon me, so I'm eating it. She doesn't care. She's living her best life. Hashtag health. <laughs> Back in the car, we're heading home to put Ruby in her pumpkin costume. Um, and I fe felt like we could go over what my results were. Oh my goodness. It's a little heavy on the brake, don't you think? No, it was not intentional. Oh boy. All right, so. Um, we, we both also only had one beer. Let's just make that clear. So we're both totally fine. Anyways, right? We should say that. So they don't think that you've had like 17 beers yeah. and are like I've, behind the I wheel? I have barely had 17 beers like in my whole life. <laughs> okay, fine. All right, so. No need to worry. No need to worry. Um, my chip time, or slash gun time, because they're both the same, was 57.57. So under an hour, great. Um, overall pace was 8.09. All right. And overall, I was 66th out of 313 runners and um, I was fifth out of 34 women in the 30 to 34 age group and I was 21st female overall so this is pretty good this is kind of where I thought I would be today I was hoping to be more like in the, the high sevens like 750 range um, but I didn't quite make it there today. Um, but that's expected because I haven't really been doing a lot of speed work. I was doing a lot of like longer mileage. Uh, so I'm not really like conditioned for like that type of running right now. The last time I did this course was back in February of 2020, right before COVID hit. Be quiet! And I averaged 7.36 that day, same course. Um, so I definitely wasn't expecting to have that pace 
hoping for it, wasn't expecting it. I'm happy with today's results. It wasn't anything serious. I wasn't going out there trying to like, you know, get a world record. So, you know, like a... Yeah, I thought you were. Yeah, I thought, yeah. I know, I know a lot of people thought I was, so I wanted to make that clear. Um, yeah, I had fun. So if you enjoyed this video, don't worry, you'll still see Ruby, but you have to stick to the end of the video. If you enjoyed this video, please like it down below and subscribe when you're done with all that. Hit that notifications bell so you can find out every time I upload a new video. I have another video for you on Sunday, but in the meantime, get out there, get on the grind, and don't forget to run like Heller. I'll see you next time. Is that your Halloween costume? Everyone look at Don't Judge Our Messy House. Oh my goodness. You look beautiful. Oh, that's beautiful. She does not like it. Good girl.